let us talk about Hermite interpolation formula. Hermite interpolation formula <coughs> is special in a sense that here we have the values of y as well as its derivative for n plus 1 nodes. Okay? So, it is different from uh, all the <coughs> other interpolation formulas usually where we have the values of the function only. Here we have the values of the function as well as the values of the derivative of the function on the respective points. So, we have altogether n plus 1 and n plus 1 to n plus 2 arguments or nodal points. Hence, we assume that Hermite interpolation formula is a polynomial of degree 2n plus 1 which we represent as uix yi plus vix yi prime satisfy <coughs> linear combination of these two values, these two modal values, functional values as well as the values of its derivatives. Obviously, Hermite interpolation formula gives us flexibility and accuracy in terms of determining the polynomial y in terms of its arguments x since we have values of the function as well as the values of the derivative of the function. So, we write it as linear combination of this where this uix and vix are polynomial of degree 2 n plus 1 and we choose it as aix plus vi into lix square and vix as cix plus di into li square x where lix is nothing but the <coughs> Lagrange interpolation function lix defined to be x minus x 0 dot 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 x minus x i minus 1 dot 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 x minus x n by x i minus x 0 dot 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 x i minus x i plus 1 dot 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 x i minus x n. So, this is obviously a degree of a polynomial of degree n because we have skipped x minus x i in the numerator and here we have used x i minus x 0, x i minus x i plus 1 and x i minus x n and we have skipped x i minus x i which will obviously become 0 and make it undefined and using the relation we can say uh, we can see that l i x i is 1 actually we may write l i x j as crone cut delta i j this is the very vital relation or property of l i x which will be used here and that is why we used this Lagrange interpolation uh, function l i x ok so this is the scenario of Hermite interpolation formula so, let me again jot down the polynomial and the <coughs> conditions on it from which we will determine the undetermined cons constants. We take this to be the Hermite interpolation formula. Okay, clear uix yi plus vix yi prime. We have the conditions that h2n plus 1 xi will be equal to yi and h2n plus 1 prime xi is equal to yi prime. So, from these two conditions, since we have taken uix as aix plus bi into li square x and vix as cix plus bi into li square x. We have chosen ui and vi like this and the conditions of the values of the function and its derivative are this. So, if we take a look at this, to con fulfill this condition, we must have, see, li x j 
is chronic heart delta IG. So we must have from here AI XI plus BI equal to 1. Isn't it so? Otherwise, we would, wouldn't have this equal to YI and CIX plus DI equal to 0 for all I. This is for all I. Since whenever we put I here, we have chronic heart delta IG relation and this makes it 1 and this makes it 1 to get this equal to Y i and this must vanish otherwise this will not be fulfilled. So V i x is 0 for all i and A i x i plus V i sorry sorry this is 1 sorry this is 1 I erroneously wrote it as 0. This should vanish and this should be 1 why because whenever L i x j is connected delta i j and to match it we must have ai xi plus bi equal to 1 so that this equal to yi all the other terms are 0 and here all the terms are 0 similar when you take the derivative we must have ui prime x we are taking the derivative this is constant equal to 0 for all i isn't it so and vi prime xj is chronic at delta i because h prime 2 n plus 1 xi is y i prime. So, v i prime xj must be chronic at delta ij so that it matches and u i prime x must be 0 for all i so that this becomes 0 for all the terms. So, for these two conditions we must have this set of conditions. Now, let us take the derivative of u i x and v i x. We can easily see that since the structure of these two functions are same, if we take the derivative, let me write it here, if we take the derivative of <coughs> uix and dix, ui prime x becomes, when you take the derivative of this, it becomes ai li square x plus ai x plus bi into 2 li x li prime x and we can take li x common so that we have ai li x plus 2 li prime x into ai x plus bi like this ui prime x is like this and this is equal to 0 since for all i for all i this is 0 and we know that a i x i plus b i is equal to 1. So, if we put x equal to x i here we have a i l i x i plus 2 l i prime x equal to 0 and we know that l i x j equal to delta i j. So, l i x i is 1 and from this relation we can easily write that a i equal to minus 2 l i prime x. Clear? From here we have a i equal to minus 2 l i prime x since a i x i plus b i is equal to 1 and l i x i is equal to 1. So, we have this value. Now, let us take the derivative of v i. If we take the derivative of v i, we have obviously similar type of terms. It is very easy to find that <coughs> v i prime x is nothing but c i l i square x plus c i x plus d i into 2 l i x l i prime x and we know that v i prime x j is chronic at delta i j. So, this is chronic at delta i j and you can write it as c i l i square x j plus c i x plus b i 2 l i x j and l i prime x j. Clear? And we know that this is 
Kronecker delta ij. This is Kronecker delta ij. So we can cancel this and we have 1 here. We have Kronecker delta ij here. We do not have this here and we have like this. And to match it, let it write it as like this 2 li by xj. And since vi prime xj is equal to delta ij, if we put here xi, x in place of xi, we must have ci equal to 1 and di equal to minus xi. Sorry, ci equal to 1 and di equal to minus xi. Because ci xi plus di should be 0 and ci should be 1 so that this matches. And if ci is 1 and ci xi plus di is 0, we have these two values. So, these are the two values we get, two set of values we get from these conditions. Another is this, which gives di equal to 1 minus ai xi. This is another value. So, we may put them together to find what is actually the <coughs> structure of interpolation, Hermite interpolation, polynomial of degree 2n plus 1. It is <coughs> fairly complicated, but <coughs> let us remember that h2n plus 1x was assumed like this, we should remember initially and uix and vix were well, like this and we have found out from the condition that <coughs> condition is that h2n plus 1 xi is equal to yi and h2n plus 1 prime xi is equal to yi prime those two conditions gives us these values like this and if we put up these values here what we get is nothing but see this is a i x and what is a i a i is this and what is b i b i is this so if we club these two relations we have nothing but but 1 minus a i x i b i is 1 minus a i x plus x into a i plus is actually well, x into minus 2 l i prime x i actually this is l i prime x i i forgot to put the x i here a i is minus 2 l i prime x i so this is b i and this is a i x a i x plus b i and this into we have l i square x Whereas, what is vi, vix? See, vix is like this. ci is 1 and di is equal to minus xi. So, we have this is nothing but ci is 1. So, this is x and this is minus xi. So, this is nothing but x minus xi li square x. Okay. And <coughs> if we Simplify this relation where we have used vi equal to 1 minus ai xi and ai is minus 2 li prime x. We can write it as 1 minus ai xi minus 2x into li prime xi into li square x. So, this is the structure of Hermite interpolation formula. We can give the expression <coughs> in a compact form. I will have to wipe it out first and then we may have write it in a compact form.
sorry to be late here we have 1 minus what is ai 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 is again ai is found to be minus 2 li prime xi so we should write it as 2 xi li prime xi and here it is minus 2 x li prime xi into li square x plus x minus xi li square x and now we may make it if we take this term of 2 li prime xi common it turns out to be uh, actually we should write it like this 1 minus x minus xi because that makes it reasonable So this is the complete structure of Hermite interpolation polynomial.